Well, this event came about, so David Goggins, as you know, started this uh, challenge, the 4x4x48, about three years ago. My girlfriend and I started talking about doing it back in January. And as I started training for it and building some momentum, I was like, you know what, we should do this and make it as big as we can, get as many people to do it with us as we can. And then I started thinking, why don't we see if we can get David Goggins to do it with us. And with enough persistence and me hounding them and hitting them up and creating this in environment and this event, David and his team are coming to run with us this morning. And we're really excited about that. It started at eight o'clock on Friday night. So this is the 10th leg of the 4x4x48 for everybody. What's up, man? Thank it's you Christian. so much, Oh, respect, brother. Appreciate you, man. I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate this. You got some stuff on your way out. We'll thank talk you. To you on the way out. Thank you. Hey, thank you all for coming out here, man. I am going to be uh, out here with... Hey, did you come leave him? I have until 9.15. So when you come in, we'll try to get a little more organization. I want to sign every book I can and take every picture I can, all right? So let's... Uh, Get done. Yeah, yeah. Right what time is it? 7.56. Yeah. Right, yeah. The challenge to me, this is the epitome of persistence finding a way to keep moving through this, to finding a way to persist when your mind is telling you to give up, when your body is hurting. We have this amazing team of people that worked tirelessly day and night to make this happen, and here we are. So it's gratitude, that's, my, that's the only thing I could add. All right, persistence culture, familia. The man in front of me needs absolutely no introduction. He's the one inspiring us all to reach our full potentials. I have the legend himself, David Goggins, in front of me here in the persistence culture facility. David, thank you for joining us for leg 10 today. I appreciate you guys having me, man. It's a great turnout. Amazing. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's, uh, it's incredible to have you here with us. And I've been asking the members three questions. I'd love to get your take on them. Uh, question number one is, what does the word persistence mean to you when you hear it? Um, it, it means a lot of things to me. But the biggest thing it means is just staying in the fight. It means no matter what happens to you, no matter what kind of hit you get in the mouth, no matter how many times you get knocked down, you just continue to get up and move forward. Hell yeah. Uh, the second question I've been asking members is, uh, what aspect of the culture in your life do you value the most? Oh, man. That's tough. That's tough. I have to say consistency. Wonderful answer. Consistency. Yes, consistency, and you got to be consistent and persistent to make it through this challenge. The last question that I've been asking everyone is what motivates you every day to keep moving? Well, now it's the fact that I have a responsibility to others. So when I first started this journey, the responsibility was to me to make sure I could look at myself in the mirror every morning. And then once I got that in my head that, okay, this is who I am, the responsibility now is to every man and woman out here to make sure that they realize that their true potential far exceeds what they think. I love that. David, thank you for realizing that you're a man bigger than the body you walk around in and you inspire us all and just, just keep moving and we'll keep moving with you. Hey, respect, brother. Thanks yes, a lot, sir. Man. Thank you. Persistence culture. Persistence, firm or obstinate continuance in a course of action in spite of difficulty or opposition. Culture, the customs, arts, social institutions, and achievements of a particular nation, people, or other social group. 